Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Now, before we get into the Airsoft review itself, I'm gonna jump straight toward it, towards it. Thank you so much for the view counts on my videos. My most um, recent, like, high view video is about to hit 3,000 views. 3,000 people have watched that video. It, 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 it amazes me, thank you so much. So, it would very, I would be so appreciative. As a kid myself, just trying to buy guns, review them. I don't have a job. I can't get a job at my age. So making money and stuff by doing chores and working at a grandma's house or something, it's pretty tough. You don't get money every hour. You just get a little bit every day. So, I mean, it's hard to work for it. But, yeah, my views have gone up a lot recently. I just want to thank everyone for it. So, yeah, let's get on to the review. I am reviewing the Crossman M14 Spring Action rifle every time you prime the gun <laughs> you pull the trigger and it shoots yeah that's how it works <laughs> so start up starting up with the review front orange tip us orange tip comes with almost every airsoft gun front iron sight corresponding to the rear iron sight four picatinny rails up at the front sling mount another sling mount the gun is fully polymer, by the way. Just wanted to remind everyone. Nothing is metal. Nothing is cheap plastic. It's all polymer. Um, magazine. It's your, like, this one, it's all polymer as well, but it's just like all your other cheap springers. Just load it up into the little hatch. Oh, jeez. Open the hatch, pour BBs in. Close your hatch. Pull the spring down and just shake BBs into the magazine. That's how most of them work. But yeah. And then, put your magazine in, prime the gun. If you didn't notice already, this is the charging handle. Your bolt does not open like the real M14 would. If you just pull it back, it's just the, the, whatever you want to call it. But, yeah, so, um, the gun's pretty simple. I got it for around $40 off of Amazon right now. I'm really looking for kind of cheap guns. I can't get expensive guns currently because money, as I said, is hard to come to for a kid. So every little bit counts. So I've worked up a bit of money and I actually, I'm upgrading my PC as well. But I've got a couple guns to review and this is my first one that I'm gonna do for the month. So how you get the magazine out, you push in this little lever, just like the AK that I reviewed, you push that in pull the magazine out you don't have to put it in any certain way you just push it in and yeah the safety um push it into the trigger guard that is on safe push it outside the trigger guard it is now hot ready to shoot so yeah um just a reminder if you are a bit young um or i, I know i'm young but i'm saying like younger than me um the gun will be pretty long, so getting this charging handle would be kind of a um, struggle if you had short arms or something, but um, for any 11, 12 year old, I'm pretty sure you can do it just fine. But um, yeah, I'll shoot off a couple rounds just to give a little hint of what the gun sounds like or just give off like any, whatever you want to say. That was out of ammo. I just shot around 14 to 15 rounds. That's the capacity in the magazine itself. But, um, yeah, so other than that, the gun's pretty simple. It's pretty cheap. It's a very good starter for backyard airsoft or anything. Bring this out on the field. Uh, the 315 FPS that I get with it isn't what I recommend. I mean, Anything else, go check out my other reviews if you're looking for something else, like the AK or the M4. Those are definitely better tier weapons that shoot a lot higher FPS than this one, obviously. Or even my sniper one. That sniper one has, like, no views. But the sniper that I reviewed was 
amazing for its price. 80 bucks for that, that, that was just amazing. But this, it, it's a decent weapon to say the least. So I really appreciate, uh, appreciate, all right, good job. Appreciate, <laughs> you guys are watching the video, please subscribe, it helps out, all right? I, I, I appreciate it, by my heart, please. <laughs> And all the love and all the um, views that I got and all the comments of people saying, like, good job and stuff. I'm not going to lie, there are some mean comments. Well, not mean, but, like, people just, like, giving a hint, like, learn your airsoft terminology. But I've been playing airsoft ever since I was five or six. And I know that's very young, but this was literally my battlegrounds right here with my neighbor right here who just moved out, like, a few years back. This was our battlegrounds. Like, we all used to play right here with our cheap little Springers and mini M4s, whatever, that you see all over Amazon. <laughs> but yeah, that's that's what we used to do. So this is definitely one that I recommend for backyard airsoft. Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video.